if you guys ever feel stuck on Instagram, just realize that is not true. Like that is so fucked up that you think you're stuck because guys, there are 800 million daily users on Instagram every month. Don't even give me that bullshit. You're not stuck. You're just not reaching out for it. Hi, so welcome to my channel. My name is Jade and today I felt like calling you. Yes, you up. So I'm really energetic. I had freaking way too much coffee and I felt like sharing some of the energy to you guys and answering your deepest, darkest questions about social media. We do on the show, we just call you guys up and you guys ask me whatever. So I hope you guys enjoy. Honestly, I'm I'm like trembling. Like so much caffeine and so much sugar. I was actually previously working on my app and filming another project for my company, but like low key, I couldn't. We have a caller right now. We're gonna see what's up. I hope you're not creepy. I really hope you're not creepy. Dude, Dude, Hi. what's up? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Jake, this is real. <laughs> what's your name? Where are you from? Um, I'm Gianfranco Robaslavi from um, Belgium. Oh my gosh, Belgium! You were just on my Instagram live, right? Yes, I was. What's up? How can I help you? What's up? I've been trying to grow my Instagram for like three years now, or something, mm -hmm. and I don't know. I'm just like stuck at between seven, eight hundred. It's just like not really growing, but I'm really putting work into my photography. Yeah, what do you think is uh, what do you think is why people, you know, what's your biggest problem right now? I have no idea. Really? I, I should I should work on my captions. What do you think? Do you, do you think it's a content problem? Like people don't think you're good enough, or do you think you're not working hard enough on distribution? No, I, I don't think it's a content problem because I go to a photography school for okay. like four years now. So okay. I, I really put effort in, into my content. Yeah. So you think that people just don't pay attention to it? Yeah, maybe. And how does that make you feel? Do you feel sad? <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> okay, so what have you been doing marketing-wise? Well, um, I've been trying to use some hashtags. That's it? Oh, it's just like hard. I'm just under a lot of stress right now. Oh, dude, okay, okay. <laughs> what, what, what's, what's your stress? What's, what's holding you back from doing more? You're asking a lot of hard questions right now. I know, <laughs> that's the point. You know me. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to interrogate you. I was you prepared. I didn't know you were actually going to call. Dude, I know. I don't even know why I'm doing this. <laughs> what do you think your goal is with this whole Instagram thing? Like, what's the outcome you really want? Do you just well, want to do it for fun? Like, pursue the dream of being uh, an artist, of course, in, in the photography uh, Okay. Business, you know. So you want to get paid? Yeah, of course. What do you think? How much money do you want? Well, I'm <laughs> graduating next month. So. Yeah, but like, what do you think? If I was a genie, okay, if I was like, yo, dude, I can give you your dream. What? Well, how much money would you want? Around, around the hundred numbers to start off, of course. Like Wait, a hundred. A few hundred euros a month. Just a few hundred? Just just a few hundred? You don't want? Just start out, yeah. Okay, okay. What about the dream? What What's your dream? Like, how much would sustain you in Belgium? I don't know how much it costs. Okay, the dream. Live. It would be like to start off around like two thousand. I would do the following. I would DM. So if you're stuck at eight hundred, there's no such thing as stuck. I would go yeah. to you know how like Instagram. Okay, so like literally look. So you know how you go to Instagram, right? I don't know who this girl is, but like you know there's like a little down bar right here. Like, do you see that? And so what I would do is literally go to the people you work with and just start DMing all of these people. You can actually have an endless amount of people that will have a relative content to you. And Instagram already tells you who you should DM. So if you go to suggested and you just DM all those people, those are potential followers. And it's more targeted because the algorithm is telling you, okay, these are people you might like to follow. And that's what I would do to get past 800. If you want to go past 1,000, sounds like you have a big dream. I would definitely just take time of your day and Literally, if you can't, if you make friends with the models, ask them to refer you. Be like, if you like my work, please send this to five yeah. people. That's what I would do. Right, okay, great. So that's free option. If time and money is a problem, literally do that and let me know how it works, okay? All right, I'm gonna go. Have a good day. Bye. Okay, have a good day. Bye. You guys are so cute. I can't, I love you all. Okay, so now we're going to the next caller. If you guys ever feel stuck on Instagram, just realize that is not true. Like. That is so fucked up that you think you're stuck because guys, there are 800 million daily users on Instagram every month, okay? So don't even give me that bullshit. You're not stuck, you're just not reaching out for it. If you're in the right mindset where you think about opportunity and optimism instead of pessimism, pessimism? pessimism you're gonna do so much better so i don't want to hear anymore i'm stuck that's not true there are 800 more million users you need to outreach it's up to you i just got a random call hi oh my gosh how are you how old are you i am 12. 
<laughs> That's so cool. Caitlin, what's up? How can I, what, what do you want to talk about? Do you have any question for me? Oh, honestly, it's been great. I'll show you actually what I'm doing. So we're filming. Say you can say hi to YouTube's, but like right now, it's extremely hot in LA. What are you currently doing on Instagram? Are you doing any content? Yeah, I'm trying to not start a business, obviously, because I'm way too young. Oh no! Wait, hold up! What? Hold up! What do you mean you're too young? Do your parents not think it's cool? No. I started my first business at nine. I was selling products on Amazon. Ooh, bitch, get out the way. I think you're good. You should start. Wait, what do you want to build? What business do you want to do? Um, help people like grow. So I want to, if I become a professional photographer, I want to take pictures of people that want to be a model. Oh, so. okay. So you want to help influencers with their brand. Yeah. Okay. So what's holding you back from doing that? I don't know. I guess um, I need the right. Not equipment, but I don't... Yeah, because a phone isn't the best... What's your phone? Like... What's your phone? What what phone do you have? I have five. That's a, that's a good phone! Literally, I'll show it to you. So basically, there's a brand on in, in LA. I don't know if you heard about it, but it's really popular. And these are the photos It's of girls and influencers, and all of it is just iPhone pictures. And it's just fashion and models and you should check it out it's called brandy melville and they have four million followers so i don't think you need to worry about it there are people love right now iphone photography is really cool because it's easy and people can relate to it so i think it would be cool i don't think necessarily right now maybe might not be the best but you can start right now and later on get a camera yeah i and the second thing is i need people to like take pictures of, I uh, guess, because, yeah. yeah do you have friends like i mean not do you have friends do you have people that are like super happy to take photos? But most of them are like, oh, I'm not photogenic. What, what part of, where do you live in, do you live in a big city? I live in Manchester. Okay, that's a big city. So, so I know this might be weird because being 12 in a big city might be hard. But if you go on hashtag Manchester on Instagram, do you post a lot of your work on Instagram? Yeah, four times a week. On Ma so I'm searching, I don't know if you can see, but if you search Manchester blogger, there's endless amount of people underneath the hashtag you can DM. And they're girls that are like probably super down to just, you know, connect with you. And trust me, I know you're young, but they, they will honestly, like, I'm going to be honest. I think because you're young, you would be so cute and so like lively to someone. Like, I don't think you need to worry about age more. So just find a person you think is pretty or you want to work with. And there's a girl right here named Rosalita. And she's in Manchester and she's a fashion student. So, I mean, you can do that if your friends don't really want to take photos with you. I hope you have a great day. What was your name again? Caitlin. Caitlin, have a great day. Love you. You too. Bye. Thank you. Um, hi. <laughs> What's up, Thaddeus? I mean, who are you and where are you from? <laughs> uh, I'm Thaddeus. I'm from Washington, but I'm in Peru right now. That's so cool. What are you doing in Peru? Uh, I was on tour with Drake Bell, doing some content. Is Team Atlas there, or is just just you? <laughs> uh, well, it's me and, yeah, like, I got my boy Kai right here. Can I roast you? Yeah, go for it. Yay! Oh my gosh, wait, this photo, I think I've seen this before. I've seen this before. Tell me that I don't, tell me why everyone's in the bathtub. You know, I don't know either, I just thought it was cool. Yeah, okay, so my first roast is, I, I like how you made it look like it was your concert. I really like it. Do you want to say anything? Do you want to say anything to the, the Dharma Nation? <laughs> All right, check out that Issa's channel, Pop Tag. Wow, you're famous. Awesome. Peace out. All right, guys, that puts the show onto conclusion. You guys are so dope, and maybe I'll do more throughout the day. So yeah, I'm gonna catch you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. I love you so much. Seriously, the moment I call you guys, I feel so much more energetic. Even I had too much coffee, you guys make me feel like a good type of energy. And I hope this was valuable to anyone starting Instagram. I just want to know my honest thoughts. Super grateful for every single one of you. Shout out to the comment winner. Shout out to the comment winner. Comment on this post to be featured in the next episode. You want to be the next comment winner? Comment below your thoughts on today's video. Thank you so much for everyone who participated and let me just awkwardly talk to you, you know? Like this video and subscribe and go check out the end cards to see a little bit more of my life and vlogs if you'd like to catch up on some of my videos. So I'll see you guys later. Mwah.